Hello everyone, welcome to another vlog. It's been a while. Fortunately, it is such a gloomy, rainy day. And as you can see, or I don't know if you can or not, but it's kind of drizzling already. I'm going to DC anyway. I was going to meet a couple of my friends. Uh, some of my American friends are going to watch cricket. That would be interesting, but it's going to be in enemy territory because we're going to George Mason University. That's why I couldn't wear any of my GW outfit, just for the sake of it. I know I'm pretty sure that it's not like in the UK, you know, where I would get mugged off or something. Oh, that was a scam call I'm from at and Hopefully, this will be a good vlog, entertaining. I'll also give you guys a brief history about Cherry Blossom Festival. It's supposed to be called Sakura in Japan, but why is DC celebrating it? Find out soon in this vlog. Okay, time to dig in. So I reached Tidal Basin, but unfortunately, as you guys saw, there's not much cherry blossom left. I've been scammed by Google search. Apparently, they said it's gonna last from May 30th till mid of April. It's the 9th of April, which is like not that late but I guess I guess I missed it um, you can see one tiny tiny tree down there it's been a disappointment but right now I'm in front of Thomas Jefferson Memorial so let me check it out I once came here I came here like two years ago but I didn't check it out inside there is some renovation going on with like the dome and stuff but uh, we'll see also I'm kind of close to the uh, Ronald Reagan Airport which is why you'll see a lot of Aeroplane flying around this area. All right, let's just go to a Thomas Jefferson Memorial and see uh, What's in store over there? Well, okay, that is not what I expected. Uh, I think we can go in great. I'll just climb those stairs Oh my gosh, it's quite that's, that's, that's quite nice Alright, don't know what to do next, but hopefully we can head back to uh, the Abraham Lincoln Memorial and possibly see something over that side. Man, I missed all of it! Not a single tree in this area is blo blooming, uh, bloomed. Ah, uh, you know what? You know what? Alright, you know what? That's the Lincoln Memorial backside. But well, you know what guys, I'm gonna give you guys a brief history talk about the Cherry Blossom Festival. United Airlines. In 1912, the mayor of Tokyo, Yukio Ozaki, gifted the then American president 2,000 cherry blossom trees from Japan. But as you guys know, cherry blossom happens well it's supposed to be only happening in Japan which is why it's called Sakura so when he gifted an American president 2,000 cherry blossom trees to plant as a gift what happened was that it was infectious all right so it was infectious so the president the American president just went like yo burn that thing down and he burned everything down now usually when someone gives you something and that person burns it down you might retaliate and do something else but the Tokyo mayor was so nice that he gave 3,000 orders I mean, 3,000 shipments delivered to Washington, D.C. And that, those 3,000 trees are planted across the Tidal Basin. And every end of the March, during right before spring, it blooms every year, almost at a similar time. Now, there is a indicator tree, which kind of tells you when exactly does the cherry blossom happens. Because that tree has something, I don't know the science of it. I'll do link a video which is made by Nat Geographic. That explains it a bit more better than what I'm doing right now. But um, there's this one tree around the Tidal Basin where that indicates that the cherry blossoms have peaked or not. So that's the story. So instead of retaliating, the mayor of Tokyo gave 3,000 trees and they were planted all across it as remembrance of their friendship. I don't know. Just being nice, maybe. But then there was a World War II that happened 20, 30 years after that. So yeah, I mean, I'm kind of disappointed that I didn't get to see much of cherry blossom. But hopefully you guys can see the footage that I got last week and the week before.
when I came during lockdown, the whole area was empty, you know? Like you would barely see any of these people. Um, but yeah, it's like things are getting back to normal. I just wish the Smithsonian museums open up again. You can see this is like my favorite place to jog. Uh, when I used to live nearby, I used to almost come here like every two, three day, a time a week and do a jog inspired by Captain America. I don't know if you guys have seen, seen the scene but Chris Evans and uh, Anthony, what is his last name? Well, Falcon and Captain America, they do their running over here um, where Captain America catches up with him in an extra round or something. Uh, so yeah, I mean, I'm kind of disappointed that I didn't get to see Cherry Blossom because, um, yeah, I missed it. Today's a bit cold day and I do remember researching that before spring, if it gets really cold on one day, that means it's over. Like the, the, the cherry blossom that would fly away and get withered and the trees would not have any of those beautiful petals remaining, which is what we could see here. It's all green and that's it. I mean, it is pretty, but it's not as pretty as cherry blossom. With that, I'm going to bounce off from here. I'm going to go to Virginia to George Mason University to see some cricket actually. All right, people, I've made it to the enemy territory. Yeah, I'm in Vienna, not the capital of Austria, but a place in Virginia. You know, I'm actually so surprised that there's a lot of traffic, like how it is in Dubai, P getting PTSD driving from Sharjah to Dubai and vice versa. I'm waiting for my friend to pick me up. It's still not rained yet, which is good. Hopefully it doesn't. Cricket stops when it rains. Whoa, look at these duckies. Of being in my car yet. No, not really. <laughs> so we are parked here. I played the new map. I was so confused about the on cricket. Oh, a new task. Yeah, oh, the, I think most of them are new. Oh. Yo, that is such. It's crazy. Please let him go twice. I want to see that. I think I'm doing it right. I'll just keep it rested over there. Well, I just burned my stick. Uh, I, yeah, I, uh, is this normal? <laughs> yeah, what should I do? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh. Wow, I could do it. Hey guys, I just got back. I didn't vlog much in the end, but I just had one of the best nights I've ever had in America with amazing people, all right? I know I'm not sounding that high because I'm a bit exhausted and I need to sleep early, but yeah, I'm so grateful, so grateful. Thank God that I met the people that I met today. Looking back at everything, I do feel like there was a reason why I missed my flight to see my family back before Easter. Because God has ways in which he plans things for each people, each individual. And I think I know why he didn't want me to go that time. I am 
so so happy with everything that happened today i miss cherry blossom so the day started off with what do you call in a sad vibe and then eventually it got much sadder when i couldn't even watch cricket properly things were just getting bad luckily it ended in a very high gonna rest now and yeah thank you so much for watching the vlog make sure to hit the like button if you did like it subscribe if you want to watch more of my content anyways i'm gonna go ahead to bed uh take care of yourself take care of your family and uh yeah stay in touch bye bye